All right, get those chemicals ready, Victor. Yep, I just finished up seven. Fantastic, let's go bring it to Strange. Alrighty. Professor Strange, we're ready. Oh, well, fantastic work, Dr. Crane. Our test subject is waiting now. Where are we? <laughs> What's happening? It's okay, Mr. Eikens. We're just gonna run a quick test on you and you can be on your way. Fear toxin's ready to go, sir. I'm sorry, fear toxin? Yeah, fear toxin. It's easier to say than fear chemicals. That's true. Okay, may you please put the rag in his mouth. Now please inject our test subject. Yes, sir. J just be careful with that thing, Jonathan. <laughs> this toxin better work, Dr. Crane. Vital signs seem normal. He must have passed out. Well, I gotta say, Dr. Crane, I'm impressed. <laughs> I told you it would work. Yes, you did. Thank you very much, Dr. Crane. I'm just happy to help. Well, I will get Dr. Valentine to carry Mr. Eikens back to his cell. Professor Strange, may I please keep using this fear toxin in my sessions? I've already proven to you that I can help. Well, I guess you have. Okay, Dr. Crane, you may continue to use it in your sessions. Yes, thank you. You are not gonna regret this. There's a lot of people that could really use this. Well, I should head back. All right, we're gonna have more test subjects. I guess we should go make some more. Let's do it. Nigma. What's up with you, Laszlo? <laughs> patient passed out. I had to carry him back to his cell. Right. All right, come on, it's entertainment time. Ooh, fantastic. Ooh, y'all got a TV. This place is fancy. Today on Gotham News, we'll be discussing the disappearance of the vigilante known as the Batman. Wait, what? Somebody turn that up. We go live now to our reporter who is discussing the topic with a Gotham City citizen. Thank you. I'm here in the Gotham City streets discussing with the citizens about the disappearance of the Batman. So, sir, do you have any opinion on this? Well, I think it's kind of a crazy coincidence that Batman disappeared the same day that they found the Joker's body. So what you're saying is you believe that Batman is responsible for the death of the Joker? Well, I ain't saying it's for certain, but it can definitely be a possibility. Well, you heard it there, folks. Do you believe that the Dark Knight is the one that killed the Joker? Maybe we'll never know. Back to you. <laughs> Nigma, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, Edward. You're going back to your cell. I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. The Joker's dead. Batman's gone. This is so much too going to be true. Uh, Gotham City, here I come. <laughs>